Dear students, welcome to Brilliant Minds e-learning school. This presentation is for grade 10. New hello, O level book. Unit 8, Robot. The internet is the best invention that we have today. You can find information about anything you are interested in. It's really useful if you need to find out something for a school project. For example, I would never be able to do my task without it. The internet also makes life easier in your free time. You can buy anything you want online with a click. You can also communicate with your friends easily, even if they live abroad. In my opinion, we have been inventions like GPS, Global Positioning System. This is the best invention. GPS helps you to navigate your journey from one place to another. You can use it when you visit a town that you aren't familiar with. In the past, people needed maps to get around, but GPS is more useful because it just tells you what to do. If you don't know how to go somewhere, the technology will tell you exactly where to go. Most cars also and buses and other vehicles need petrol, but petrol is becoming more expensive. And what would we do if we didn't have petrol anymore? We now have something which is called the hybrid vehicles. Hybrid vehicles use both petrol and electricity to drive the engine. For this reason, the vehicle uses a lot less petrol. There are also cars that are only electric. At the moment, they cannot go long distances, although they are useful to travel short distances like school or to the shops. I mentioned some words like GPS, hybrid vehicles, find out, get around, and go out. Can you guess the meaning? There is a hint to help you. Let's check the answers. Supers. Now with the grammar lesson in this unit, which is if conditionals. If conditionals is talking about the ability of doing actions in different tenses. In this unit, we are going to have if conditionals in three terms. Zero conditional, first, and second. Zero conditional. What do you think we are going to use this conditional for. Zero conditional is used to talk about scientific facts or actions usually happen. So the percentage of doing these things is 100%. For example, if you boil water, it changes into steam. This is a scientific fact. If I have free time, I use my mobile phone. This is also happening. We had right now. We can say that zero conditional is F followed by present simple and the second one present simple two. 
and this is the rule of this conditional if present simple present simple and surely you know the form of present simple which is verb comes in infinitive form or we can add s or es to the verb first conditional we use this conditional to talk about future possibilities from present situations which means something happens right now and a future possibility will happen after this if you study hard you will pass your exam if you need to send an email you will use a computer if present simple we can use future for or will can shall or may any one of them followed by infinitive form what will you do if the weather is fine maybe if the weather is fine i'll go out so can you determine the verbs let's have another example staying at home saving your life if you are going to apply the rule as we said before f present simple will can shall or may followed by infinitive form yes if you stay at home you will save your life let's talk about the second conditional as we agreed that the zero conditional is talking about scientific facts first conditional is talking about present actions which is going to happen second conditional we use it also to talk about present situations but are imaginary ones something unlikely to be happened also we can use it to express wishes and hopes so first conditional is talking about something will happen in the future this one i don't think so for example i can say if i had a lot of money i would buy a bigger house this is a present situation i want to do but i don't have enough money to buy this big house can you determine the verbs f past simple would could should or might followed by infinitive form let's have this example i can't understand the lesson so i want to answer the questions this action is right now in the present case and something i can do type what about if i had the ability to do it let's remember the rule if past simple would plus infinitive the first verb can't understand so it will be yes if i understood the lesson surely i would answer the questions but it's imaginary situation that i can't understand it and in the present case second conditional can be used also for something else as we said wishes or hopes but let's have first another example i have no money to go out so yes if i had money i would go out we can use the second conditional to give advice the normal way of giving advice is by using should shouldn't had better and so on 
for example, I should revise my lessons, or I shouldn't shout in the class. But by using the second conditional, we have expression, which is, if I were you, I would, plus infinitive form. If we are going to apply this structure on the previous sentences, it will be, yes, if I were you, I would revise my lessons. And the second one, yes, if I were you, I wouldn't shout in the class. Let's revise what we had. Zero conditional, the usage is for, yes, scientific facts. The rule is, what the form of this conditional? If, present sample, present sample. First conditional, can you remember why we use it? Yes, for future possibility. And the rule is? Yes, if, present sample, will, may, can, shall, any one of them is accepted, followed by infinitive. And the second conditional. Yes, wishes or hopes, imaginary situations, or to give advice. If, past simple, would, might, could, should, any one of them is accepted, followed by infinitive. And surely the way of giving advice? Yes, if I were you, I would, followed by infinitive form. This is the way you are going to use in a choices case. Two parts, present, present, zero conditional. Present, well, first conditional. Past, would, second conditional according to the meaning of the sentence. Rewrite the following sentences. Heating iron makes it expand. Which case we had? Yes, relating to zero conditional scientific facts, it will be if present sample Present sample. If you heat iron, it expands. I don't have your email address to send you. Present situation. Yes. If I had your email address, I would send you. You had better come early. Advice. Sure, if I were you, I would come early. Thank you for listening. Until the next time, stay safe.